Sometimes you might be creating a quick reference guide or something that you're going to need to capture a screen grab that has a hover menu or a drop down menu that comes up when you hover your mouse over it. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can use the Microsoft snipping tool to delay it so that you can grab that, um, that hover menu that might be elusive when you're trying to get a screenshot of it. Be sure to check out my other video on how to create a quick reference guide. This tip will come in handy if you're creating a quick reference guide. We're also going to take a quick look look at the Windows 10 Snip and Sketch tool, which is a, an enhanced version of the classic snipping tool. So let's get started. Let's say I am on the website here and I wanted to give my audience instructions on how to search on this website. And when I hover my mouse over the search, this pop-up menu comes up. But when I go to use the snipping tool, which all I have to do is go down here to my search window, type in snip, and the snipping Microsoft snipping tool comes up. Now you can pin this to your taskbar so that you can access it easily, or you can just search and open the app whenever you need to use it. But you notice when you go click new, like you're gonna grab a screen grab, um, it will come up and you can't grab that that pop-up menu. So the way that you want to do that is to actually set a delay on your screen grab. So it'll give you a couple of seconds so that you can go and make that menu pop up by hovering over it and then you can grab it. So all we have to do is come up to delay on the snipping tool and say delay for three seconds and then click new. And then it's going to give me some time to come over here with my mouse and get that window to pop up. And now I can grab that screen grab with the hover menu that pops up. And then it automatically copies onto my clipboard. And let's just say I'm going to paste that into my document and uh, draw some arrows here and give people instructions on how to search on that website. So that is how you can use the Microsoft Snipping Tool, set the delay on it so that you can grab that hover menu. If you noticed in the Snipping Tool, when we clicked New, we saw a little message that popped up that said, hey, try Snip and Sketch, which is the new Windows Snip and Sketch tool. So let's take a quick look at that and see the difference. All right, so the new Snip and Sketch, it looks a little bit different. It's, it's a different menu that pops up. When you want to do a new sketch, you can drop down and you have the option to snip immediately, snip now, um, or give a three second or a 10 second delay. So you can set that option. And so if we use the new Snippy, Snip and Sketch tool, uh, we'll delay for a few seconds, and then your window comes up like this, where you have the option to do a rectangular snip, where you can draw with your mouse a rectangular box, or you can do a free form snip and draw the area that you want to snip you can uh, click on that option and it'll take a picture of the window or you can do a full screen snip and if you click on that it'll do a snip of your entire screen so then you can um, come into your word document and paste the new uh, snip of the entire your entire window like that so that's a preview of the new Snip and Sketch and how to delay it so you can grab those elusive hover menus when you're tr attempting to do that. If you found this video helpful, be sure and give it a thumbs up to like it. You can hit the subscribe button to subscribe to my channel and click the bell to receive a notification every time I post a new video. If you have any comments to share, be sure and leave them in the comment section below. Visit my website at SharonSmithHR.com. And thanks for all my viewers. I'll be sure and see you on my next video. Thanks.